Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Diaphne. If you're new here, welcome, bienvenue, and thank you for clicking on today's video. As you can see by the title, today is another exciting video. I'm doing my 2021 luxury wish list. I know a lot of people usually do these towards the beginning of the year, but you're allowed to dream and wish at any time. So I decided to put mine up. This list, <laughs> I love talking about it because it's forever changing. For sure, I would not remember all these things if I did not write them down. Sometimes I do some sort of, how can I say, like a mood board kind of thing. I broke it down into categories, you guys. Some of these things you're going to be like, what? But to me, I think they're luxury. Let's get into my list. For adulting things, my first wish is to buy a house or own my first property. So I think that's a pretty good first wish. Now I have a little problem with shopping. So we kind of, I'm putting myself on a no buy so I can save and save and save. The second thing is to become debt free, student loans, credit cards and everything. Nothing is more luxurious than being debt free trust me okay third thing i would say is finish my master's degree fourth one is increase my credit score i don't want a good credit score i want a great credit score so the sooner i pay all my credit cards and my loans and everything and just know more about finances business how to grow how to invest all of that stuff all of those are like one package become more financially literate also more business savvy as well and my sixth one is to reach 10,000 subscribers by the end of this year not impossible it's it's a far you know what i'm saying it's kind of far from where i am right now but 800 i'm almost at 800 now 800 was also very very far when i first started and i had zero so we're moving slowly, but we will get there. So if you're watching this, share the video, subscribe, tell your auntie, your mama, your brother, your sister, and we can reach it. You know what I'm saying? Getting into bags, luxurious bags. I want a Gucci, I don't know the name of it. It's like a box thingy. It's cute. I want it. I think it's a collab with somebody i'll put it on the screen you guys will see i also want a cake bag from ysl patent leather in black and it has the emblem the ysl emblem in gold i think it's so pretty like i want okay i want i do also want a ysl toy lulu but i like it in the nude color my only thing about this one is the strap is leather and i don't really like the leather strap on that specific bag so we're gonna see but i like the size and the color of the bag a chanel backpack in red i don't usually have anything in color in my wardrobe but i saw that chanel backpack in red it just looks so good like i just love i just died you guys like i love it it is so cute i would definitely want that in my collection like for sure a fendi bucket bag and i also want a fendi the tote shopper thing i think it's just so luxurious and so cute it is a bigger bag than i'm used to but i think it's super cute what other bags do i want i do want a classic chanel bag either in nude or in black i probably would get a nude one first knowing me like a classic chanel bag like the trendy cc I would definitely get a nude in that one. Like, I think that bag is just so pretty. For jewelry, I want a Tiffany & Co necklace, the one with the heart. They're not too expensive, so I wanted to look into them because like you see, I like dainty necklaces. By the way, you guys, I will be doing a jewelry collection from affordable fashion and fine jewelry. So be on the lookout for that. A Tiffany & Co Elsa ring, the gold one with the two diamonds. I want a VCA ring, a VCA bracelet, the mother of pearls with the one motif. I really, really want that. I think it's super cute. That's the one I was interested in at first. And then I saw the one with the black and I was like, oh my God, that one is cute too. So I added it in the wish list last minute. I do want a Cartier. Ooh, I think I want the bracelet 
with the diamonds just un clou bracelet with the diamonds just the bracelet is fine but when i was thinking about it i was like i want it with the diamonds call me crazy i already have a cartier love ring but this one is the wedding band size i do want a regular size one to probably put on my thumb because this one is just too small for that i also want a cartier love bracelet and i want a rolex big just watch the lv louise earrings i know those are super super popular but i think they're super cute and i think they can jazz up any outfit because i have my um dior earrings and i wear them all the time so i figured if i got the lv earrings i would also get a lot of wear out of them i was also looking at the fendi ones very nice okay a ysl brooch i think it's called crocodile embossed something it's like an all gold i think it is super cute and i want to get it i want to get it now you guys keep in mind all of these things are just things that i wish for it doesn't mean that i'm gonna be able to get even 80 percent or 70 percent of these things because they are pretty pricey things and you know like <laughs> i do want the chanel double cc earrings i feel like those are the only fashion houses that i would want you know some earrings from i think it's chanel i got the dior i want the lv i want the fendi and I think maybe the Gucci studs, but not really, just because, but not really, you know? Moving on to shoes. For shoes, I don't really want that many shoes right now. I do want a Tom Ford padlock sandal. I want the nude. I love the gold, but I'll probably just get the nude. <laughs> it's something about these shoes that I really want. The Gucci loafers. I want the white and the black one. I think those are like nice flats to add to your collection and you can have for years. Some Gucci trainers. The white ones, not like all up in your face Gucci. I think it's super cute, so I do want those. And I do want some red bottoms, some black red bottoms. I just don't know which style I want yet. Some nude red bottoms as well. I think every girl should have a nice pair of nude and black shoe in their collection. I already talked a little bit about the accessories. I wanted a YSL brooch. I do want a Chanel brooch as well. I want some Chanel sunglasses. Actually, I want the oval. I have the square ones. I'll put it on the screen for you guys. But I want the oval one because I think they just give different look. I have a Gucci hat that I really want for those bad hair days. I don't know why. Like I don't really like Gucci bags, but I love Gucci accessories like their hats their shoes their belts i do want i have like a louis vuitton card case i do want the ysl the black one with the gold emblem on it i think it's super classy and i think it's a little more dressy so i do want that and i also think i want a ysl uptown pouch but i don't really know which color yet but i do want it let's see what else do i want for accessories I already talked about my Rolex. Yeah, I think that's pretty much all I want for accessories right now. For perfumes, I do want the Delina or the Delina Exclusive. I do want the Dior Ombre Nuit. I heard Edwige à la mode talk about it. I want it. MFK oud satin and the oud silk because they smell absolutely amazing. Maybe soon I'll be doing items that I checked off my wish list if I if I ever get any of these things. Yeah, so this was like just a little chit chat. Let's talk about my wish list kind of thing. It's nothing serious. I hope you guys enjoy it. If you have anything on my wish list that you also have on your wish list, comment down below. Let's chat, girl. Let's talk about it. I want to thank you so much for watching. Thank you for hanging out with me. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I will see you guys very soon in my next video. Bye.